Enormous demand for infrastructure is expected as a result of economic growth around the world, particularly in emerging countries. However, what is important for infrastructure is not merely existing but being of good quality. Japan has been advocating quality infrastructure on occasions such as the G7 Isashima Summit. Yet what does this actually mean? Quality infrastructure not only ensures economic efficiency, but also safety, reliability and operation, sustainability and resilience as well. Operation and management costs can be reduced by using unique structures and highly durable materials. By implementing the safety management methods used in Japan, the level of safety is improving on site as well. Quality infrastructure greatly contributes to local communities. We are transferring expertise and know-how to these communities by actively hiring locals as workers on site, conducting human resources development through training program internships and so on. Furthermore, we give due consideration to the social and environmental impacts which the infrastructure may have. By undertaking construction in consideration of peripheral traffic and adopting original construction methods, we try to minimize the influence on the surroundings as well as prevent environmental contamination during construction. We strive for consistency of quality infrastructure with both national and regional level strategies. Japan's advanced technologies are utilized to achieve long-desired national projects, while regional bottlenecks are removed by these technologies contributing to economic development. Quality infrastructure can be developed by effectively utilizing financial resources. We mobilize not only public funds but also private sector resources. The Ministry of Land, Infrastructure, Transport and Tourism established the Japan Construction International Award in 2017, which has been given to overseas projects accomplished with Japan's strengths and symbolizing the quality infrastructure that Japan is advocating, as well as to small and medium-sized Japanese construction companies that are active overseas. Construction Projects here, we will introduce 10 excellent overseas projects in which Japanese companies have been involved in various stages, such as planning design and construction work. The project for construction of railway flyover in Ulaanbaatar City. This is a project to construct a low maintenance and management cost 262 meter overpass bridge and a 362-meter approach road over the railroad line that divides the northern and southern parts of Ulaanbaatar city. This was named Narni Gur, Taiyo Bridge, as it is infrastructure symbolic of the friendly relationship between Japan and Mongolia. By improving logistics access, it is contributing to economic growth and improvement of the lives of the citizens. Senayan Square Project This is a large-scale mixed-use development occupying a site of approximately 20 hectares close to Jakarta's central business district. Comprising a shopping mall, office buildings, luxury condominiums and a hotel, this environmentally friendly urban development effectively utilizes private funds to provide high-quality residential and commercial space for the local community. Tilawa Special Economic Zone, Zone A Area Development Project. This is a large-scale industrial park development project undertaken by public and private initiatives in both Japan and Myanmar. The project achieved high-quality, environmentally friendly infrastructure based on Japanese design standards and construction techniques, such as seismic design and flood control measures to deal with the severe climate conditions. The development boosts the expansion of Japanese companies into Myanmar while contributing to Myanmar's economic development. The project for construction of Nik Long Bridge. 
As part of Asian Highway No. 1 and the Southern Economic Corridor, this is one of the largest cable state bridges in Asia, crossing the Mekong River with a span of 330 meters. By taking erosion into account in the foundation design, the project achieved a high degree of resilience while keeping costs low. This bridge made it possible to safely cross the Mekong River fast and free of charge, which contributes to the economic development of East Asia. Pahang Salangor Raw Water Transfer Tunnel as the longest tunnel in Southeast Asia, with a total length of 44.6 kilometers and a diameter of 5.2 meters, this tunnel was built to transfer raw water to the capital city of Kuala Lumpur and the Selangor State for daily life and industrial use. By constructing a long-distance tunnel with a gentle gradient using the state-of-the-art technologies of the Japanese firm, including highly accurate surveying capabilities, thereby eliminating the need for pumping facilities on the downstream side, the project achieved quality infrastructure with high life cycle value. Hamad International Airport This new airport passenger terminal construction project which is also the national project of the Qatar government, is one of the world's largest airports. Under the severe conditions of the desert climate, the project not only made full use of a Japanese company's know-how in achieving a low-cost, wave-type roof to form a large open space, it also could respond smoothly to a major revision of the plans without stopping construction and adhere to the desired construction period. Bosphorus Strait Crossing Railway Tunnel Project Called Turkey's 150-Year-Old Dream, this was a major national project to make Istanbul a connection point between Europe and Asia. The two continents were connected by an undersea railway tunnel thanks to the advanced technology of a Japanese company that included constructing the world's deepest submerged tunnel at a depth of 60 meters and the world's first connecting of a TBM tunnel and immersed tubes underwater. Marina Coastal Expressway Contract 485 this is the first submarine tunnel in Singapore and is the country's largest dual five-lane road. The project succeeded in an unprecedented worldwide achievement in which construction was carried out in two stages. And 1.4-meter diameter steel pipes used as a temporary support system for excavation were pulled out after the end of Stage 1 and reused in Stage 2. At the same time, it achieved high leakage prevention standards through the use of high-quality Japanese-made materials. Mitsui Outlet Park, Kuala Lumpur International Airport, Sepang Malaysia's first outlet mall and the largest in Southeast Asia opened on the Kuala Lumpur International Airport premises. Utilizing the excellent know-how of a Japanese company on the development, operation, and leasing of commercial facilities, the project contributed to the revitalization of the regional economy through job creation and transfer of operational know-how. I-70 Twin Tunnels Widening Project this project was part of the Interstate 70 upgrade project widening the road from two to three lanes in each direction between Denver, Colorado and the Rocky Mountains. The CMGC delivery method under which a contractor is hired and involved in the design phase was the driver for Japanese advanced tunneling expertise to merge with a diverse local knowledge of the project owner, designer, local stakeholders and vendors. The project was successfully completed by reducing construction costs and shortening the construction period while maintaining public safety during construction. Small and medium-sized construction companies Here we will introduce seven excellent small and medium-sized construction companies that are engaged in work overseas, including construction, design, and surveys. Kido Construction Company Limited 
This company is playing an active part in Indonesia and Myanmar through its outstanding pipe jacking method for laying pipeline and its efforts to disseminate and raise awareness of the technology. Sakai Heavy Industries Limited. This company established a business style of expanding its sales channels for construction equipment through providing local technical transfer. It sells products to more than 130 countries around the world. Jesco Holdings Company Limited. This company is mainly active in Vietnam, conducting strategic business development in both design integration and construction management through aspects such as precise risk management. Taiyu Kansas Company Limited. The porous pavement asphalt modifier this company developed in-house has been provisionally certified as a new technology by the Vietnamese government and has received high praise during testing construction in Thailand and Malaysia. Tamada Industries Incorporated With a foothold in Vietnam, this company is engaged in the manufacture and sale of double-walled tanks and the provision of fiber-reinforced plastic laminated construction for aging underground tanks in various countries in Southeast Asia. Marushin Shitaka Construction Company Limited Starting with its acceptance of trainees, this company expanded its business in Nepal and Bhutan and has been developing its business by building a network with the local community and performing as a pioneer company by receiving orders for local public works projects. Yasuda Engineering Company Limited With its excellent pipe jacking technology and business strategy, this company has been awarded a large project worth over 10 billion yen. This company also has made significant contributions to expanding local job opportunities and transferring pipe jacking technology in Vietnam. Japan will continue to supply funds to the infrastructure sector around the world and promote quality infrastructure investment. Japan stands ready to help with the development of quality infrastructure in your country as well.